Hey guys, today I'm going to be sharing with you my classic happy planner and I'm going to be decorating with another one of Fran's kits from Grand Plans and this one is called Park Picnic and the reason why I chose this kit is because of all the bright colors and it's just beautiful which oh, I just think all of her kits are beautiful. I mean honestly if I didn't think they were beautiful I probably wouldn't buy them and I want her whole entire shop but one I don't have enough time patience or space to be printing all of those <laughs> kits and I know I can store them on my computer and I can have them later because that's the beauty of a printable shop but um, I just don't need to go crazy <laughs> Anyway, um, as I have said before, I'm not a PR girl for her, but I will PR for her, I guess. I'm, well, that's what I'm doing, right? Like, sort of, kind of, well, I'm bragging on my friend. That's what I'm doing. Yes, because she's awesome. But anyway, let me shush about that and get to planning. Um, I'll show you the kit, but I do want to find, I think I have, let's see. I should have put the Daylight Saving Starts in last week no y yeah hmm <laughs> anyway it starts on the 10th so i should have put it in the week before last but i didn't what i'm looking for is to see if i have a spring begins sticker i don't think i do not in these and i can't i well i could look in my books but I don't have anybody here to get the boxes down so I can't like lift them yet but the time is coming when I'm gonna be free but that's okay I won't have first day of spring or anything like that for the 19th um, I just won't have that and that's okay I don't, I don't have to have that unless I have it I did have Where's that book at? I just pulled, oh, there it is right there. I might have it in some of these stickers. I should have looked for this before I got started, but I didn't think about it because that's what I do. I don't think about things until later. This is mostly like budgeting stickers and then no stickers because it's not full which is great that means I have space to put other things but it does have some holidays and things there's Christmas Eve day New Year's Thanksgiving Black Friday Columbus and, mm, no spring okay that's all right I would love to have one that says spring has sprung or something like that because it's so cute to have something like that but that's all right it didn't matter this is springy enough um but the 19th is the first day of spring this is for the 18th through the 24th and i wanted to do this for that so let me show you the kit it is called park picnic and look at the colors and my printer actually still um because of this paper is still not as vibrant as it was online but look at the colors i mean they're beautiful on this kit. They worked out great. I mean, look at that with all the hot air balloons and all the birds and all the pretty. But anyway, there's that page and then there's tons of boxes and some headers here. Beautiful, beautiful kits that she makes. And then um, like the Muddy Through set, uh, Sundays, some checklists here and then more down here. So there's a total of six of those. Is there only six of those this time? Different kits have different things. There's the numbers, and then there's some boxes, and there's three heart checklists, and then um, habit trackers and some bill dues, and some swirly twirlies. I don't really know what those are called. That's just what I call them. Some asterisks there. And look at these cute little icons for doing all your uh, things you don't want to do. Some more headers, some sidebar headers is what I call them, some flags, more little squares, I would say those maybe like for layering maybe you could do with or just whatever you do whatever you want with them and then some more stickers here and those look like little headers as well but you could use them for stickers I may use them for headers this time we'll see I want to try to remember what all I have so I'm gonna kind of set my box my pages up um, in front of me 
and beside me so I can see these four pages. Technically, this is eight pages because you could cut it in half, but I did not do that. So that's, you know, the way it's happening for me. That's not going to work very well, but maybe it'll stay. I don't know. We'll hope that it stays. But I'm going to go ahead and put numbers on the date dots. And I'll just scoot that over there. I want to, I have been kicking myself lately because I'll have, um, been planning on using some certain box or something from one of her kits or, you know, something that she has there. And then I'll totally forget about it because it's, you know, when I'm flipping through filming, I won't see it until I'm done. And then it'll be too late because I've already covered the spot where I was going to put it or something like that. So I want to try to make it better for myself and see the things. But I thought this was appropriate for the first um, week of spring. It's not the full week, but the next week after this one will be Easter. And I want to use an Easter kit that, yes, I got from Fran's shop. But as you guys know, um, if you've been watching, if you're, you've been here for a while, and if you have, thank you so much for coming back. And if you're new, thank you for coming. Thank you for visiting my channel, and I hope you like it here. Don't remember, I, mean, I don't, blah, blah, blah. Um, I don't have just planner videos on my channel, so there's that. But anyway, I had surgery. At this point, it's been almost five and a half weeks ago. So, I can't do a lot of things. So, I'm just, I printed off a bunch of kits before my surgery so that I didn't have to get my boxes out and stuff. But I do love the kits, and it's a great excuse to use all the kits. But I don't only use kits, I use books, um, I use kits, I use things that are not. Wow, what happened to that? My voice went bye bye that are not actually meant for planners, that is not, I don't want it to go over it, so I need to move maybe a little bit to the left, y'all may hear the dishwasher in the background, because, um, okay, that's just going to have to do, they're going to be a little bit different than normal, but anyway, um, before Jeff went for work, went to work, it was finished loading up, loaded up after he ate his lunch, and then I just, I can push a button, <laughs> so I turned it on, um, but I can't do a lot of things, but soon, soon, very soon, I will be back to my old habits, <laughs> which I know people probably think I'm crazy. I have had people are like, oh my goodness, take the break, you know. You know, I'm done with the break. It was it was okay at first. It was fine at first. But now I'm like, uh-uh, I'm done. I, I don't want to do this anymore. I want to go back to my old habits before I lose my habits. Because that's one of the reasons why I want to get back into the swing of things is because I have a bad habit of if I don't do something for a while, I'll forget how I did it and then... I'll have to create a whole new habit and learn a whole new system, and I don't want to do that. I know that's further over, but I don't want to have those overlapping. I, I just don't. This is not for Happy Planner. I should tell you that. This is for a standard vertical, and um, or like uh, Erin Condren or something like that. An Erin Condren kit, uh, not kits, but planners have a space between... Um, the boxes, so this would not fit the same way in an Erin Condren as it fits here. But I'm okay with that. I'm I'm just fine with that. I love it. I don't I don't mind. I am gonna go ahead and put this down here, and because it does uh, normally have a space, um, it's gonna need a little trimmy trim, a little trim, unless I want it to go over, which I could do, but I'm not going to do. Okay, get that lined up over there. I should have just put it up there in the beginning. Oh, 
Okay, could you stop being a weirdo? I can't seem to get it lined up with my own, like, self. Okay. So, I'm going to put this down. But, yeah, you do not have to use everything that, you know, you don't have to get specific kits for specific planners. You can do different things if you want to. It's your business. It's, it's Have fun with it. And I don't always buy happy planner kits because sometimes I will find a kit that I like that's not a happy planner one. And y'all, I'm trimming on this side. And the reason why is there's more floral things over here and it's more like a, a path or walkway there. And then there's green over here, but I want the more colorful things on this side. So I'm trimming this side over here. So this is the way I should have done it the first time. So I didn't have to pick it up. And I could mark both sides. And it doesn't have to be perfectly marked. It's fine if it's not. It's just a guide for you. And, you know, if you mess up, please don't beat yourself up about it. It's okay. It doesn't matter if you mess up a little bit. Um, you can always stick it back together because it is a sticker. And not only that, you can trim a little bit more if you need to. Um, actually, Fran and I have been having discussions about the Happy Planner pages, too. I'll talk about that in a minute. But if you make a mistake... Be like Bob Ross. Just make a happy tree. It's okay. Not necessarily a, a tree, but a figuratively, you know. I think that's the right word. Um, just make it work for you. Like right now, I'm having to make this work for me because I got that crooked. I cut it crooked. So I'm going to go over here and start. Instead of on the other side. And... Put it down now we have been discussing the happy planner pages and the undated now i did not pay attention to the dated pages that much because i haven't used many dated happy planners i usually get undated i like them better you can use them anytime you can buy them ahead of time whenever you find them on sale and you know you can just use them whenever well anyway we've been discussing how that happy planner i want to know thought about putting that up there but that won't work it's not um it's too wide but i also thought about putting it right above this but i may not do that either anyway the happy planner pages one side is like it's printed differently like if you line this up let me see if i can get this to work right if you line this box and this box up the proper way um, this side is just a smidge up higher than this side and also these boxes um, whenever I put that sticker down this goes a little bit more into that than it does on this side I'm not gonna fret about it it's fine I'm not gonna be beating myself up and saying oh my goodness what am I gonna do and having a fit I'm just gonna go with it I'm just gonna let it be what it is and go on about my business so the first thing I want to do is put in some um, the what are they called <laughs> I'm not I don't want to put that one there I don't I don't want to put that there because I don't want the green on green one of my doggies is barking I want to put in the nope my brain just said bye. <laughs> the boxes, the pretty boxes, the pictures, the, that, yep. And there's no to-dos or anything in this one, so you don't have to think about that part. But, um, and I'm not doing color blocking either. And if you don't know what color blocking is, it's like, I would put green, whatever's green. Like, and then whatever's the red, or whatever's the blue, like the header parts. I would put like whatever like this is mostly blue I would put it oh stop it in this one but I'm not gonna do that and the reason why I'm not color blocking is because I don't have 
the patience for it today. I just don't want to. No, that's, that's not right. It's not that I don't have the patience. I just don't want to do that today, I guess is what I should say. It's just not something that's on my priority list. All right, so there, there's that. And then I'll go back with the red up here. But yeah, I'm not color blocking, but I do sometimes. It's fun to color block sometimes, but I'm not this time. Okay, so I, I do have a double box. This one right here. Oh, I got two double boxes. Hmm. This one, she's got the middle part done more too, but I'm not going to worry about the middle part. Or maybe that's just the bleed for my... I don't know. It just looks like it's more colored there too. I was not going to do... There's nine boxes, so I'm not going to worry about that one being a double box. But I am going to do this one. Hmm, why did that go off? I'll be right back. Okay, my camera on the front porch when I was like at my door, my front porch camera, whatever, it doesn't matter. And um, I was wondering what was happening because nobody was knocking or anything. But uh, it must be the friendly neighborhood squirrel because there's no human there. Or many of the friendly neighborhood squirrels because we have a lot of them. All right, so what I'm doing for the double box down here is I'm going to put these two beside each other, the same color header. Now, um, I won't have anything up here, like box-wise color, like the pictures. But I made sure that I had some on these two rows, just like I have on these rows, if that makes sense. But I don't know what I'm trying to say. Other than I try to make the rows match, or that's not properly said. I try to make sure something's on every single row. Now, I am going to turn this around so that I can match this up as closely as possible because I want the scene to be a full scene, and I want it to be like that. Ta-da! Very pretty. I love it. Okay, so now on this, let's see, what am I going to use for the sidebar? I think I will use this one as the full box for the sidebar. Now, another thing about this Happy Planner, this particular one, um, this part, the little grid, is wider than your stickers. Don't know why. But it is. So, that's something I have to think about when I'm doing all of this. But I want to go ahead and put in a header. Hopefully, I've got it somewhere close to the proper place. I'm almost positive that I don't. Which is why I'm thankful that I did not put it all the way down. I'm trying to line it up. Maybe I should put this other one down first, the full box. I don't know. But I want to pick, put a picnic basket. on both sides. Somehow I got that picnic picture crooked and these boxes did seem to the full boxes themselves they do seem to be the same they are they're wider than what normal is let me see if I can just put it right there okay so I do not have this straight but they're the Full boxes are a little bit wider than normal. I don't know why. I don't know if it's maybe it's something I did or if they're supposed to be, but I think it's something I did because y'all, my cricket be wonky. It's crazy. It's crazy, crazy. Okay, now I'm going to put another picnic basket over here on this one because I want one on each side. 
I don't want it to be different on the side. You know, oh, well, that's not properly said. I want it to be different, but I want to be able to have um, the, I want it to be symmetrical. Is that the word? I don't know. I want it to have the illusion that I tried. <laughs> when honestly, Fran makes this so awesome, you don't have to try very hard. Okay, so I'm going to put this one up here because uh, I like the balloons and things. It looks like there's kites maybe. There's like heart balloons. Get that straight. They are wider than the boxes, but that's okay. I know it's got to be something I did. I'm going to put this house down here. Well, it's a house with a garden. There's like a house back there, if y'all can see it. It's so pretty. I like that. I was trying to mainly show you the house. Okay, and then I'm going to do, I think, this one. I like it better than I do that one because that one is more blurred out and this one is not. But, um, Allie hears me talking, so she wants in. So let me go let her in. Okay, so you may hear the pupper doos in the background now, but that's okay. They're part of our family. They're part of our life, so pups are part of it. Okay, so now I want to go ahead more over here on the sidebar. I'm going to move this over, and I'm going to work on the sidebar so that I can get it done. I'm not putting much over here right now because there's not much that I can physically do right now. So, I'm mainly just putting the meal plan or meal tracker. I have the meal plan on my monthly. And then what we actually eat, I've been putting in here. Which I think I may continue doing. It's not what I was doing. But I think I'm going to continue doing that because it seems to work out really good. All right, so I'm going to put this one that says habits in. Put that there. And then I'm going to put the two habit trackers. Which ones do I want? I think I want this pretty yellow and the red. That is a Bill Do sticker. I picked up the wrong ones. Okay, put that back because that's what I picked up with both of them. I could put my bills in this part because I do use this uh, planner for the bills as well but I don't normally do that maybe I should start doing that but I just pay them like the week that Jeff gets paid because we are a one income household other than what little bitty tiny bit I get from YouTube which is not much and I'm not complaining because I'm not gonna complain about it anything's better than nothing right anyway um I just go ahead and pay the bills Oh, I don't want to put red right there. Let's put the blue. The reason why I don't want to put red right there is because there's red right there already. That's why I didn't put the yellow there because the yellow is there. Break it up and make it prettier, I think. Sometimes you can just not break it up and it's fine, but I prefer to break it up. A little bit. All right, now I'm going to put the meal sticker. Allie, you, what are you doing? She's making some kind of weird noise back there. All right, so I'm going to use the green one because there's not a lot of green represented over here. that one in. Then I'm going to put the last one of these. And then I'm going to take that very last one of these and put in here. Now, if this was like normal and I was not recovering from surgery, 
I would have a checklist over here for things that I need to do, but it's no certain day I need to do them for like chores or something, but I don't have that here because I don't need to. I think I'm going to finish this off with this yellow, uh, just a um, plain, uh, what are they called, header, because I don't have any more of those like these that I've been using. Okay, so since I don't have a what is it called even? Since I don't have to do today's all those things, I'm thinking I'm gonna use the glitter headers and maybe I can find some to do somewhere else. I wanted to see how that would look up there. I think I'm going to use it. Let me just pick that up and ruler. I'm going to cut that off. I'll cut it off right there. This is not a slice tool, but it's similar to one. It's just a little cutting tool with a ceramic blade. I got a whole bunch of them in a pack from Amazon. I think they're in my Amazon on my Amazon on my Amazon storefront where that you can go and um check out the stuff that I enjoy and they'll be under planner if I do have them on there. But they they're a, more like a safety blade. I did not cut that far enough in. And the reason why is because I have the spear that I'm going to cut my desk. So let's just do it with the board that I should have just grabbed in the beginning. And the magnetic. Um, what is this called? Ruler. That came with it. Then I'm not afraid of cutting. Well, I just did not, still didn't cut far enough in. It's all a pressure thing. If you don't put, apply enough pressure, it's not going to come up. But I have this weirdness about me that I'm afraid I'm going to cut my paper and I'm afraid I'm going to cut my desk. And this is made where it can cut through one layer of paper and be done. Yeah, I think that's good. I may put something else over on that side. I don't know yet. And let me go ahead and grab this one. And then this whole sheet will be gone. I'll be done with this sheet. I'm going to go over to the top of that header. And I'm not going to let that go all the way. Like, lay down all the way. See, now that didn't bother me so much to cut through because I had the paper there. But I didn't cut through this paper. Because if I had, it would be cut right there. But as you can see, there's no cut if you can get the shadows out of the way. That's why I like the ceramic tools. But these did come with a bunch of um, metal, like regular blades too of these things, a ton of them. I don't remember how many. I'm going to stop talking about them. I don't sell them. I just, I like them. And I started out with a slice tool, but I have just about worn that thing out. And I found these when I was looking for a slice tool, and these were a better price. So I thought, well, I'll try them out. I just cut my magnet. Whoopsies. I probably should have my reading glasses on. Oh, I just went crazy. Okay. Well, that's a fine how do you do. What did I do? I didn't cut through. 
Okay, let's try this one more time. And if this does not work, I am going to go for the scissors. Because it's not the tool, it's me. I don't use it a lot. Still didn't cut it right. Oh, good grief. Come on, lady. Just cut the sticker the proper way. I can't seem to do it today. But I got it. Kinda. Mostly. I made it a little bit fuzzy in a spot, but that's alright. We'll pretend it's the grass that's fuzzy. And we'll get that up and we won't worry about it. All these little doggy toes. Hello, ladies. Got the dogs and then the cat. All the critters. Okay. So this page is done. So I'll get rid of it. Ma'am, you cannot be under my feet. I know that's where you enjoy being. But you cannot do that whenever I'm sitting this close to the desk. I messed that up. Because I just did. I don't know why. Well, let's get back to this. Now, what I was going to say is, since there are no to-dos, which a lot of her kits do have to-dos. This is a smaller kit than her normal ones. Um, since there are no to-dos in this kit, I am going to just use the glitter headers. And I'm most likely going to use glitter headers to cover up the other black lines here. But I did want to look in my reusable sticker books and see if I have any to-dos that are just the words. Those are not the ones that I'm talking about. I used to have... But I don't know if I still do. Not in that one. And that's not a reusable sticker book. Okay. I don't think I will in this one either. These are like leftovers from kits and things. I have a lot of stickers that say to do like this kind of thing, but I don't want to. I don't want to do that when I have all these pretty headers. Um, I just don't want to do that. Where's my big reusable? Oh, there's not going to be any in here. I'm pretty sure. See, these say to-do, but they're not that kind of to-do, what I'm looking for. These are mostly like bill-do's and stuff. Like I said, this is my budget one. Yeah, none of that in there. I don't know where I put my big... Yes, I do. To buys and things like that. Uh-uh, what was that? Oh, she grounded her own self. Okay, so I don't have any in here. Alright. In that case, I will look at my big reusable sticker book. I need... To, like mark these things but I don't because I don't actually keep them like organized because I never know what I'm going to use up and have to put in there I have a sticker stuck to my finger all right I've got that kind of to do's but I don't want those I just want the words, and I used to have some. 
This is wasting a lot of your time and mine. Well, not really mine. This is actually kind of fun for me. Oh, why did you do that? You get over here with the two goes where you belong, please, and thank you. All right, so, no, these are all from friends stuff, too, these right here. But no to-dos there. Today's, I can use those. Okay, there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay, I've got plenty. I'll use those. Yes, okay. So, I'm going to set this. I had gotten this out, too, to see if I had anything in there. But I don't think I'm going to have anything in there, either. So, we're going to put this away. I don't need it. We're going to use the Today's. That's perfect. All right, so we're going to make sure that we put those in yellow. Wait. We're going to put it down here. And the reason why is because I want one on each thing. So let me grab all these yellows. I need all of them. And I will have a header on each one of these lines. But just certain ones go with certain things. This green header is crooked which means the box is probably crooked. But it's not crooked enough among... Oh, I've already got that page done. Hello, okay. All right, I need one down here for sure. And one here. And up here and then the other one will just go right here I'm gonna go ahead with these today's and I'm gonna just stick them in like this so you don't have to throw away your leftovers I do not throw away my leftovers, unless they just do not apply to me at all, or, now, if they don't apply to me and I know somebody that can use them, that I can just give them to, I'll give them to them, but if they don't apply to me or anyone I know, I just, I do get rid of those, but it's very few that I get rid of. It's so few that it's really not even enough to even say you'd really do it. Um, but yeah. I don't get rid of my leftovers very often. And I do not remember where these came from. I don't remember the shop that this these leftovers came from, but um, it was from a long time ago, from years ago. What have I gotten on there? See, and now it says today. So I'm going to close this. I wonder if there's a spring sticker in here now. Probably not. I don't think I have those kinds of stickers in this. If I do, it'll be from a shop or something, and it may not match, like a sticker from a shop that, uh, like a, a full box or something, maybe? Oh, wait a minute. There's some fall back. Hello, fall. There's fall stuff. I don't have anything back over here, so, um, no spring stuff, no, just fall stuff, lazy day, picnic, stuff like that, which is fine, I don't have to have something for that, it's fine, it's beautiful and it's springy, you don't need a word that says it, okay, so now I want to go ahead and put in my full boxes but as you know I only have six of these so what I'm gonna do is on Saturday and Sunday I'm just gonna put a three um, heart 
checklist because Saturday and Sunday, not as much is going on. Mm, I don't want to put the green there, so I'm going to put the green over here. But I also don't want to put the um, green in the middle because I have a green header there. What am I doing? Can you put the sticker down? Okay, nope. Mm -mm. Let's just turn you upside down. Remember to make it work for you. Do what you need to do to make it work for you. Because you're the one that you're the one that has to be happy with it in the end. Okay, so this one can go here. You are the one, or you're the one. Whatever language you want to speak. <laughs> okay. We're going to put the yellow here. No, we're not. We're going to put the yellow down here. Because we need it on the today, right? Alright, so there's that. And then, what colors do we want next? We'll start with... Oh, I don't have any more yellow. Let's do blue. Let's do blue, 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 blue. We'll do blue. And then, so let's see. What do we want to do for these two days? We don't want green here. So we're going to do the red. Okay. And we don't want the red or the blue here, so we're going to do green and yellow. Let's do the green here. And I could actually make these six heart and have it multicolor, but I am not going to do that. Because like I said, on the weekends, we don't really do a lot, so there's no point. That one does go over a lot. Hello, ma'am. So I am going to trim that just a little bit on this side. Don't be afraid to trim your stickers. It's okay. And I think this is because my Cricut. Because my Cricut made me do some weird stuff when I was printing this kit. Um, oh, I didn't cut it well enough. So let's do that again. I'm always, even though I know this is designed to not cut through multiple layers, you can cut through multiple layers, but um, I'm always afraid I'm going to cut through too much. I may go ahead and cut all of these down. And Fran does tell you exactly how to cut the stickers, but, and she'll help you if you need help. See, that one did great. Let's stick that there. No? Okay. But sometimes my Cricut machine is wonky. I don't think it likes me. I sometimes wish I would have gotten a silhouette, but then I hear other people talk about how their silhouettes are wonky, so... Maybe it's just cutting machines, period. Okay, that didn't work out. Allie, stop bumping my desk. She's over here beside me, scratching and bumping my desk. I don't know why, but she has a very bad habit of doing that. She does have a skin disorder that we give her Benadryl for and there's nothing else we can do about it. Oh, I messed that one up a little bit. Why do I keep messing up the green things? I don't know. Let's go ahead and do these other ones too. I moved this one over a little bit. You know what? I'm not going to worry about that one. The rest of them seem okay. It's just those a little bit further over. I'm going to not worry about it. I'm going to be okay with it and it's going to be fine. Now, is there... Wait, I gotta finish this. I want to put in some the rest of the headers. So I think I'll do the red because there's not a red, a bunch of red represented. 
other than the box it well yeah there is isn't there i don't know i just feel like i want some more red red's my favorite color anyway so why not let's do red red is beautiful especially when it's roses speaking of roses we got our first rose the other day for the season if i can remember um well i probably won't remember so i probably shouldn't say this but if i can remember i'll try to put a picture of it up maybe i'll just put it on my community tab yeah that's what i'll do that way i'll remember it because <laughs> i'll remember to do that but i won't remember to put it in this video when i'm editing because it'll be um a while before i edit this video because of when I'm filming it. I'm filming it on Saturday because Jeff had to work. So I'm filming it a couple days earlier than what I normally would. The house is so quiet though, other than the dishwasher and the doggies and the birds outside. Yesterday we had storms, so I need to do something since I can't do much of anything else, which is fine. All right, now over here, I wanted to do something. I wanted to use this this week, and I wanted to do something up here, but what am I going to do? I should have already figured this out, but I didn't. I didn't. Excuse me. Stay away from that spot if you're going to do that. I don't mind you scratching, doing your thing, whatever, but get away from that spot. I don't know why she's got to be at that spot. Yes, this is the one I want to use. All right, let me get this in here. Because I think it will work. And then I'll put this this week in. Oh, wait a minute. Went down a little too fast. No, no, no. Come here, tweezers. I want to get it just in the middle if I can. As much as I can. It won't be perfect. Nothing is perfect, and that's okay. We can live with imperfections. There's nothing wrong with imperfections. I think some of the imperfections about us make us beautiful. And I think that's fine. Some of the little quirks and crazies and differences. Okay, so, there we go. Do we have a weekend banner? Did I already ask myself that? I do have lots of pretty icons I can use. I do not have a weekend banner this time. That's okay. I'm not going to worry about that. I may have one just hanging out in here. I used to have one from Fran, but I think I used it. It was from one of her kits. But I think I did use it. It was on this page, I do believe. All right, so none there. That's all right. I know it's the weekend. We're not going to fret over that. That's fine. I mean, I have some somewhere, but I'm not going to dig for them. So, let's go ahead... Put it back in so we can see how beautiful it looks inside. And no, I have not started writing in this one yet because it's not time. That's also a kit from Fran. St. Patrick's Day kit. So, that's it. It's beautiful. I love it. It's so pretty. Look at all those colors. And I used all the full boxes because of me not needing a checklist on this side. But if I did need a checklist on this side, this kit would have been perfect because it had the, just the right amount for the, of these. I still have all of these boxes I can use if I choose to in here, if I need them. I have all these beautiful icons and all these headers and things. Whatever I don't use, I will use later at some other point in time. I've got work stickers. I've got all these beautiful things. And um, I can use those. Now, this is a small kit compared to a lot of friends' kits. So, um, it's, it's, it's just not as big as some of her others, but that's okay. Nobody's complaining. It's beautiful, and I 
love it. I love the small kits because you can do something like this, and then you don't have to figure out what you're doing with the leftovers. But I also love the big kits because I can use them in all three planners. So it's a win-win either way for me. <laughs> so that is all I have for today. I hope you guys enjoyed this. We are only in March. Like the this is the third week of March, and my planner's getting chunky. <laughs> already um but i don't mind that either i do use it for my budgeting and my menu planning and everything this is my catch-all so hope you guys did enjoy this if you did go ahead and hit the like button if you like my channel go ahead and subscribe and hit the bell so be notified whenever i upload if you know of anyone who you think would maybe enjoy this type of video or any of the others that I have on my channel, make sure you look and see because I have lots of different things on my channel. It's not just planning. Even though I do put three planner videos out a week, I also put out seven other videos. Sometimes it's just six, but most of the time it's seven other videos. So kind of check that out and make your decision from there. I don't want you to see this one thing and think, oh, this is what she does. And then later on, after you subscribe, say, oh, my goodness, this is not what she does. She didn't represent herself properly. I'm telling you right now, I don't only do planner videos. <laughs> so if you think someone would enjoy that, go ahead and share. Most importantly, leave me a comment down below. Let me know how you're doing. Leave a prayer request if you have one. I will add you to my prayer list, and I will pray for you. Um, once you are on that list, until you tell me to take you off, like, tell me, okay, that prayer is answered. I, you're there. I'm going to pray for you every day. I will transfer you from one month to the next. That's just the way it works. So, <laughs> if you want to be on there, go ahead and let me know down in the comments. And remember, don't take any wooden nickels and be sweet.